Okay. We're here. I'm just, I'm double checking to make sure my controls, it should be uh, all set. Yeah, I'm just making sure that uh, my controls are set up here. Of course, welcome everybody. It's great to be back here in this glorious space that is the Dead Space remake, hot after the playthrough on uh, the 2008 Dead Space. Seeing how much holds up. I'm just double checking. I set this up earlier to make sure the controls were set so there was nothing I had to change. One thing that's different this time around as far as control scheme goes because you know of course modern controls creates uh there's some changes some updates and how this works and the only thing that's different is sprint which is held by the left stick um left bumper is not the sprint anymore but i'm gonna try it and see if i like that a little bit better um we'll see i'm i might because yeah like there's some zero g stuff but i i might end up swapping it back to left bumper we'll see how that works how it feels but yeah, Dr. Quan Davius, welcome back. You're just in time as I get this set up ready to roll. And uh, it doesn't seem like the sound is going to be too bad quite yet. I, that's the one concern I have. I didn't test the sound at all. We're going in 100%. So if it gets a little bit loud, I do apologize. I will adjust accordingly. But here we go. We're going to Dead Space Remake. We're sticking with the medium difficulty. They have Impossible unlocked already. That is insane. Wait. Only one save slot and one life. <laughs> no, 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 no. I want to. I want to. I want to at least experience it first, and then we'll see about impossible runs. We'll, we'll we'll talk about that later. Let's. You know, we finished the original. We should be okay. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. It's time to begin Dead Space remake. It's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. This is on DLSS uh, performance mode as well. I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Strange. Such a little thing. That's her? Nicole? Yeah. First deferred from her in weeks. We're five minutes out, you still got that thing on repeat. Guess you really miss her. Fishermer is not a job you turn down, but six months apart with only fit calls. It's rough. Easy to say the wrong thing. I don't blame you. I'd listen to my girlfriend over Hamlin reciting security protocols. Forewarned is forearmed, Miss Daniels. So you keep saying. Here we go. Nice clean re-entry. Okay, already it, it, I, I saw it peak a little bit there, so I'm gonna finagle with the audio just a bit. Let's see. Imagine six months staring at that chunk of rock. To an independent miner, that's paradise. Aegis 7 is one of the richest finds in CEC history. Some prospecting team set up- Look at the ears on Hammond! I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Where is she? I'm sorry, I'm sorry! Why does he look like the guy, the, uh, The guy that's in every, he's like a villain in every film, but like, no one knows his name, like but he's a villain in every so TV dark? show. Oh my god, we should be able to see your running lights. Yeah, I'll get us into hailing range. Someone's got to be waiting up for us. Just be careful on the approach. I'm not taking any chances with CEC's pride and joy. You haven't missed much at all, really. It's just the the video. Is that why you were digging into my personnel files before we left? 
you check your file access? I'm a computer analyst. It comes with a job. Hmm. I ran standard CEC background checks with Daniels. If you want to work in the big leagues, you have to play ball. <coughs> Sir, we're in ailing range. USG Ishimura. This is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kelly responding to your distress call. Already different uh, commentary as well, different dialogue. Ishimura, do you copy? Come in. This is a USG Kelly. You ever hear of a communications blackout on one of these things? Never. Come on. Someone pick up the damn phone. What the hell is that? Sounds like their communication array is busted. Maybe a broken encoder. Daniels and I can handle it in 48 hours, max. Hey, that gives you plenty of time to catch up with Nicole. Yeah, I hope so. Jen, Johnson, take us in. Gravity tethers engaged. Automated docking. Let's go. This does look phenomenal. I'm losing control. All looks amazing. Everyone okay? A little bit choppy just right there. Hold on. I'll live. Hey, Johnston. All right. It's my ankle. Might be broken. Shit. But better than a broken neck. Or worse. Good call on the stabilizer, Isaac. That I always read the manual. What the fuck's going on with flight control? That guidance system's a death trap. Better add it to your repair list. Jen, what's our damage? Copter down. We lost the core booster. We got a fire in one of the stabilizers and singularity course of a mess. Could be worse, but nothing much. And let's get some help. Johnston. Right? Stay like this suit? Medic. Everyone else with me. Okay, like I'm not gonna lie, I was hating on Isaac's look in the first reveal. But honestly, Isaac looking pretty damn good right now, I'm not gonna lie. The new suit? Uh, ooh. You got something? How's the ankle? It's like hell. But I've had worse. You go on. I'll get it strapped up. Steve Carell? Yeah, cooler, better looking brother. Wait, is she staying on the ship? Especially in CEC stuff. Did you see anyone you'd like to throw? No, nobody. Is that a Bangalore you mean? Indeed, Isaac Newton Clark. Yo, the other pilot doesn't come with us. Location. Employee not found. 
I can't read security. Same for the chief engineer. What is wrong with her? Yeah, I'll be a frosty. Yo, there's the rig. It's, it's always Someone good to see you as well. Where's the security detail? Where's anybody? There's nothing logged. No duty roster, no power to the elevator. For God's sake. That security console is still working. Isaac, get a damage report. I'm done playing around. I mean, oh my God. <laughs> This is where shit hits the fan in just a moment. That, smell what? Like something died in the air vents. Oh. Dude. Like I can barely see her. <laughs> I'm so scared. Okay, 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 okay. I'm, I'm sorry if I'm like taking my sweet time. I am marveling at how different this is. Try that security con. Okay, folks, it's time to begin dead space. <laughs> oh, now. What have you got, Isaac? Shit. It's not just comms with the guidance system. Half the Ishimura's in the red. Engines, hull, the tramps. Who could do that kind of damage to a planet cracker? Another malfunction? No. The quarantine systems are all fine. Oh, wait. Uh, before it goes up. Because it looks like. I'm going to increase the volume. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Do you hear that? Oh, that's so much better, yeah. actually. Well, it could yeah, go a little quieter. Take it easy. Daniels, get those elevators running. You can hear it in the vents. Oh, came from underground this time. I set the lighting perfectly. Oh, boy. <laughs> this is cool. I love this. <laughs> the blood smear? I, oh, passive animation that he uses to wipe it off? Like... Oh my god. The music hits different. It's crazy. Oh, I fucked up. Oh my god. No, I didn't, actually. No, X doesn't do anything. Could y'all hear it okay? Like all the little 
twangs of the guitar. Yeah, there was little, like, it's very subtle um, before I open the door. Yeah, hear that? Like the little plick pluck of the strings. Might be too quiet. But that's the thing is like, I don't want it to peak too much. Okay, you heard that? All right. I'm gonna kind of set it at this. It might be too loud. Um, Cause if it peaks above like negative 20, it's problematic. Yo, his heartbeat though. Jesus! Oh! <laughs> Security request retrieved. It died. We shot that fucker right between the eyes and it didn't die. Smith had to shoot it. Fucking arms and legs off! For God's sake, send help! Oh, that's a different uh, message. So in this hallway, the original message is they do directly call out like the limbs. They specifically say, "Go for the limbs." Um. Okay. And it's also on the floor near this body, not on the wall like that. Well, that's cool. A little touch, a little touch. And the sway too. Like there's definitely. Like, Subtle things. There are subtle things, like he's got a little bit more weight to his body. So like if I slightly tilt, it's actually his weight kind of leaning into it before he actually starts. Uh, Isaac. Oh my god, Isaac. You made it. Just they're everywhere. Shen, is he uh He's gone. Nothing I could do. No. What the, the are these things? These two I'm not the sure, saw, but um some of them were wearing a shimmer, you know. The sound clips I'm, They're the crew? That's a good question. How, the hell can they be the crew? Isaac is for them. sure the same VA. We need to get to the bridge. There's a thousand people on board. Someone will be there. We can't. The tram system's wrecked. Everything's locked down because of the quarantine. And you're both repair techs. So how do we do this? Oh, really? Okay, cool. Thank you for looking that up. The tunnel. It's the That's system. insane. And the no, no, no. They're the same for the other game, I but I mean, like, we're talking the voice actors, until we get a if they are. The bay. But it's all on Isaac's side of the quarantine. I'll handle it. Just make sure there's power to the repair systems. And Isaac? Yeah? I'm sure Nicole's okay. She's a doctor, right? She'll do the smart thing. Yeah. I'm sure she's fine. Yeah, she always does. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon. Yo, did you see the light on his pulse rifle though? Oh my god. So that's uh, all current missions and whatnot. Replace damage tram, find the data board. New map. I like this map so much better. I'll be quite honest. That's a new... That is actually a new route. This is a brand new route. Oh. No, this isn't... This is leading outside. We're eventually going to get there. I got it. Never mind. That's not a brand new route. That's old. Okay. I think. I know getting down on the tram floor is new, though. Clean! Look how clean this game is! Oh my god. Your locator knows the way. I do like the changes to the vents before you could really see right through them. Now they're a little more ambiguous. Dr. Mercer. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Can we go to the tram tunnel first? Not. Okay. K 
Kendra Daniels is not voiced for the same. Okay. I love that there are lights on the weapons now, especially considering that there will be a lot of scenarios. Holy shit. I think the guys from the audio, cause the line was different though. What the shit? I tell you, I don't like the sprint uh, being on the left stick. Was stasis before on the B button or was it Y? Because now it's Y. She just I thought I got crushed. Now I'm pretty sure something pops around this corner. I remember it happening in the original. Fucking Christ. Okay. Oh, we go that way. Jesus, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! Oh, oh shit, that is so cool! That was cool. I don't know if y'all saw it, but I definitely did. Isaac can already see the the marker language. Like when the lights went out, the static image that showed up was all the marker language. That's why they put it on a left bumper, because it's just a tab. It's just a hold. Isaac, don't bother shooting those fuckers in the head. Doesn't even slow them down. Okay. The only way is hacking them apart. Those arms, their legs. Does that even kill them? Or do they just stop moving? That's a phenomenal question. Message retrieved. Benson to engineering. You got a stasis module handy? We need one in tram maintenance stat. The autoloader's fried. I got a damaged tram car on the tracks, and if the whole system's gridlocked, guess who they're calling? Temple here, sending a stasis module now. No idea. A lot of shit's been breaking down, and I keep hearing things. Down in the gears where, where no one could be. You know? I know. I don't like how dark it is. I hate it. I fucking hate it. Okay, we gotta. What? Where's the claw control? Oh, she was. Prepare systems online. <laughs> Loading system so reinitialized. Oh fuck. Okay. Warning. I've done this before. I can do it again. Please contact a repair technician. That's me. Oh, that was not the same. That just engaged regularly. That's different. Ah, oh, shit, fuck you. Woo! 
No, 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 no. The aim is a bit different. It's like faster. I don't know. Maybe that's in my head, honestly. No, it's faster. It's definitely faster. health pack did you use? Oh, use the medium. What the fuck? You don't need the medium. Oh! Oh! Freeze! Freeze! Holy shit! You got it. The train was jamming the whole thing. That's one down. You said a data board was fried too? Inventory says there's a spare board in the maintenance bay. <laughs> we can't run the trams without it. Wait, is that not a... Locked. Okay. Different path. Playing this with the lights off, the lights are off. Okay. You can like hear them through the walls. What's the bathroom? Inside the vents, I found a man inside the vents. Oh Y'all good? Let's make it sure. Nope. told me to bring the others. Oh, I don't like all the noises. Yeah, I think that's his boots as well, too. Like, I think you're right. Like, when you aimed at the body, like, it was his heartbeat. Because that, that's a new thing, for sure. Like, but we we heard before, like, you could hear his heartbeat in encounters. This time around, like, looking at a body alone. I swear to God, you come around this corner, I will fuck your shit up! Okay, 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 cool. All lights on, scary game, cam lights. I mean, yeah, that is... Struggle with streaming. Fuck you. What is that? You spit at me. You don't know the hell's why you just. <laughs> I 
I think the aiming issue for me right now is like there are some hitches when it gets running. I might have to finagle with like some frame rates. Oh, you hold it for a map. Okay. All right, so now oh, this isn't the headbanger hall, but it's supposed to be, right? Like, oh man. Okay, well, let's go. Hello? Oh, what the fuck? I just want to grab this and not get mauled. Appreciate it. All right, thanks. Bye. Cut off the limbs, kill enemies quickly, dismember enemies, slow them down. Yeah. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Not the tentacle monster. No. Oh, nah, nah, don't, don't fuck around like that. Is that noise? Trying to lie and wait for a victim. It got tired. Oh, you get to choose the path you want to take? Oh, hell no! Can I turn them both on? Oh, man. Oh, man. Uh... Oh, I have to choose one or the other. Oh, God. Okay. I'm going to go to maintenance bay first. Lord have mercy. Oh, no, because it was an elevator before. Fascinating. No, that's actually really cool. I know where we're at. Wow, this is really cool. This is really cool how they set this up. Wow, actually. Yo. Fuck! I'm a pro. I'm a pro. I'm a pro. Yes, I have DLSS on right now, so the ray tracing the ray tracing is on. Hell yeah. And it's on performance mode, so we're not sacrificing frame rates. 1440p. And we're sitting for sure the stream is getting it at 60. I think I'm hitting about 80. Um on here. I, I don't have a way to tell right now, but I could probably look it up. There's no way I'm hitting 100 on this, but I'm definitely hitting, as long as I'm hitting 72, we're okay. Yo, I hear it, I just don't fucking see it. I don't like that now. Jesus, I don't know where it's coming from! Oh, there it is. I just heard it. Like, I heard where. <laughs> this game you tell yourself? It, yeah, this game looks fucking phenomenal. Okay, no power. We gotta restore the power again. Like, I am. Uh, I knew I'd be fucking terrified to play this. Like, in the re. Like, just. Golly, dude. 
And it's interesting because, like, it's the same room, but it's set up differently, so... This is really cool. It's so terrifying how dark it is. Oh, hell nah. Oh, no, you, you get up, homie. Uh huh. Hey, you two. Oh, that one's dead dead for sure. Oh, that one's definitely dead. Okay. Oh. I swear to God, you fall through that vent? I'm gonna be pissed. Oh, no, no, I need the lights. Oh, thank God. Oh, fuck, no. 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 We are keeping those lights on, motherfucker. Shuttle repairs invoice, mission day two. Faulty four gyro vessel USG Ishimura 503. Three replaced now functional mission day three damage landing repulsors vessel USG 505. Um, blue replacement now functional damage four and left four viewports. Damage booster color. Wow, all right, yeah, I do appreciate like he's not talking just like to fill in the void and the silence, he's talking in moments that are just. That would make sense for him to talk. And this is new too. That I remember them kind of showing that off. Like you get to pick and choose how you want to change. So that elevator I just took down or took up here is no longer usable. So now I have to proceed on foot through all of this. Something on the background that I think might be causing an issue. That I forgot I had on. I had Origin running in the background. That's gotta go. Um. We're good. We're good. Okay, so if the elevator, no, no, I have to go through without the lights. Fuck you. <laughs> no, 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 no. There's gotta be another way. Y'all, there's no way they're gonna make me climb down here without the lights. Have mercy. Okay. All right, fine. Sir, sure. okay. No lights. Oh God. No, I need you. <laughs> uh, no, no. no.
Super clever, huh? Yeah, real clever. So happy. <laughs> I got this. What, what am I concerned about? I've beaten Dead Space before. I got this. I got this. I can't fucking see, but I got this. Where am I going? Come on over. Come on over. I heard it. I don't see it. There it is. Thank you. <laughs> the follow and the sharing of the info. Okay. 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 All right, I think we're good. Why'd they make me turn the lights off, y'all? Why'd they do that? Why'd they do that to me? I dislike all of this. You think that space is actually happening somewhere? That Hell no! Do I think it could happen in the future at some point? Absolutely. Oh, a hundred percent. All right, poker night. Keeping this off, Rig Link, in case Benson's listening in. You in for poker tonight, or are you going to let Caitlin keep walking around with your credits? Pammy, this time. This whole blaming itself over Sorosi's accident and everything, but. No one wants to hear about anyone's fucking nightmares. Especially that one where he saw Sorosi up and walking around with half his head missing. Oh, shit. And don't give me shit about it. I'm serious. It's messing with me. Last night I had one of those dreams where you wake up, you know? But my dad was sitting next to my bed talking to me. Felt so real. I kept seeing him out of the corner of my eye all day. Trust me, that's one son of a bitch needs to stay dead. You could see the level of darkness I'm seeing. Oh, my God. It's... It's terrifying. It's horrifying. It's uncomfortable. Like, I wish I didn't have this light in my face. Like, if I didn't have the lights on, this would be a completely different experience entirely. Let's check out the new node system. This is new, actually. They changed some things around here. Uh, upgrade weapons and rig using the bench. Improved the selected uh, weapon or rig's capabilities by investing power nodes in their upgrade graph. Okay, unlock new upgrades so by linking. Okay. Oh, to gain access to unique upgrades, you need to bring upgrade parts to the bench. Reset upgrades can be reset anytime. Okay, let's take a look here. So the plasma cutter now is the same route, but to unlock this stuff, I got to bring additional parts. I like this a lot better, actually, because remember in the original... There were gaps in the upgrades. Now it's just every single thing is upgraded. So like, I'm gonna benefit by spending somewhere. Um, how's the suit look? Inventory, oh, stasis zone size. So it's an AOE instead of, oh, really nice. It's all combined into one, that's cool. More HP, normsies, cool. Well, of course, plasma cutter gets the first upgrade. Cause that's all you need is the plasma cutter. I don't know if you need nodes for keys, so we're just gonna get that just in case. Alright, and we're ready to go. Got the data board. Can, we can't stay here much longer. Hearing a lot of movement. Hold on, I got the data board. I'm coming back to tram control now. Daniel, get ready to go. Uh, frame rate drop. It's on my right. I don't see it. Oh, fuck, there it is. Do 
would not make it past the first encounter if you were- No, oh, hell no! Nah. I don't think anybody would! Oh, I gotta go that way? Alright. But the fact that Isaac makes it through this is insane. Oh, this is where we started. You try to trick me with all those dead bodies there? You motherfucker. That's getting a little bit laggy. Oh yeah, that's a big drop. Mm. Do they have a what? Nah. Has no effect on performance. Oh no, it's not balanced. Oh no, 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 we don't want balanced. Definitely don't want quality. We just want performance. Whoops, that would probably solve my... No, it just made it worse. Nope, it... Hold on, we're gonna figure this out here, folks. Yeah, no, that made it far worse. Like them goddamn noises. Wait, hold on. fuck is it? I feel like they'll start doing that later on. They'll very much start doing it later on when we get to like the superpower ones. Oh yeah, they absolutely nailed audio. Uh-oh. Oh, 
I shouldn't have fucked with it. I think I just crashed it. Oh, there it goes. It took a minute. I think we can go high. Catch up. Come on, catch up, catch up. Ew, no, that made it worse. Okay. All right, we're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. Sorry about that. Okay. Oh, no. Don't want echoes. Don't want echoes. That's not cool. All right. Apologies. That's what I get for screwing around with, uh, with graphics, making sure that I have a very optimal experience, but we switched up the DLSS. We're not dropping frames. Now arriving at flight deck, track control. We're perfect. We're on board. Something hit the roof, but it seems operational. Quarantine lockdown is lifted, so you can get to the hangar. Comms are still down, though, so be ready for anything. What's the plan? You and Johnson fix up the Kellyan. We report to the bridge. Standard emergency protocol. What? Protocol? Hammond, people are dying here. And I'm not losing anyone else. Johnson is still on the procedure. ship! We'll get through this. <sighs> we'll see. And I turned off motion blur, but I just want to see. Oh, it sucks. Motion blur is not cool. No one should use it. Oh yeah, that's right. I have to return to the ship. Oh man. Johnston had a broken ankle. Space is safe.
Okay. Isaac, we made it to the bridge. It's... There's no survivors. Daniels is trying to get into the command computer. Um... Just very recently, yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, I crashed the stream uh, on accident by adjusting some graphical settings to get a smoother frame rate. And you know what? Hey, positive though, positive. You know, like we caught it right away. We're aware of it and now have a smoother frame rate. So it happens, it's just an hour. I have to splice together again. It's still a little bit choppy. Oh, she's still in there. What the hell? All right. Try this again. It would help if I plug the controller back in. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, so it took us back to the bottom of the water. Right. Much cleaner, much cleaner start. Like, look at this, oh my god. Okay. Much better. Thank you. I was prepared this time. Someone's w well ready and aware. Come on out. So much better. Yes, yeah, see, it was a reboot. All I needed was a reboot. Now the concern is I'm gonna finagle all this together in several pieces. I gotta do that for my Resident Evil playthrough anyway. You know, I just need to set aside a day where I'm just rendering video. That's what I'm doing. There's no survivors. Daniels is trying to get into the command computer. This looks so good, by the way. Like, holy shit. This is where it started dropping frames hard. And that's not the case. Oh, let's go! We're good. We're good. Reboots. Reboots fix things.
Oh, and it broke because, like, she didn't move when I tried to return. So, okay. Yeah, the game was just crashing. That's all it was. Or, like, having a hard time. We're good now, though. What have you got on you? Is that blood? Haley, I need you to listen. The way he talks. Nishimura's overrun with the fucking monsters. You didn't hear anything? What? No, the comms are still out. Isaac. We need to kill you and fix it now. Got a damage report? Yeah, it, it's there. I should have been with you. Go. Oh, no. Oh, she's dead. Oh, very different. Sold out. I need you to stop coming at me. two good people for nothing what about the command computer it's a brick all the primary systems are locked down with the captain's codes so we find captain matthias track his rig okay okay here captain benjamin matthias location medical status deceased even the captain god isaac you're closer to medical you can double back and cut through maintenance. Find the captain's body and get his rig. With his codes, we... What was that? Chen? Fun is that the uh, rest of the ship keeps going over that way. That was the guy from the beginning that got killed. Notice his body was not in the lobby when we returned. Some things have moved around. Of course, they said it was, uh, there was a bit of a video documentary where they were talking about like how, oh yeah, that guy dying, that was a big deal. I'm like, well, I don't remember it being a big deal in the original and they didn't, ever make it a big deal. How'd we go to the morgue? <laughs> Got it, cock and cook. That's a shout out to uh, Khalif Adams. Of, uh, Spawn on me. Great little podcast you should check out. Excuse me, I think Khalif for sure. Spawn on me. I was right. 
I don't know why I second guess myself, but yeah. Definitely check them out on Twitter and spawn on me on podcast services. That's a nice little reference. Pretty early on, I was wondering when that was going to show up. Yeah, the at was Khalif Adams. Wanted to make double check, because that's his name. I was like, wait, I'm not sure if, like, that's his hand. Of Fuck this ship. It's a shitty capitalist organization. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Wow. I'm sorry. I'm just fascinated at how like the blood works in this game now. It's crazy. It was just through the moments of intensity and yeah. Store is a one-stop shop. Purchase, sell, and store items for later use. Store, credits, bring schematics. Yeah, inventory. And the inventory storage. So, same thing. Also, I got DLC so I can equip skins and suits. I won't wear them, but, uh... Oh, we should we should check them out. I mean, I bought them, so I may as well. But also, like, why not? You just thought I said bonus shit. Well, bonus shit's available. Let's see. Yeah. So this is the Lone Survivor suit. We can check all the suits out. These are all the pre-order suits. Bonus shit, nah, bonus suit. Yeah, they got a little bit of wiggle to them. I don't. They're necromorph hands. Like, that's a necromorph head on my hip. Must be like necromorph body parts for all the necromorphs that you kill. Necromorph like uh, arm thing. That's cool. I got uh, the infested suit. You're just infected. Isaac has a necromorph. That's a cool one. God, the lighting. Thank you, ray tracing. Missing a stomach. That's okay. That's really cool. It's gross, but also like, it's really cool. Arm all broken up, cause it's, yeah. 
That's fun. Last but not least, the venture suit. The other two are just skins. Of uh, sit on top of it. One of them's a reference to uh Um I think it was the order for Dead Space 2. Ooh, this is a really cool suit. Reminds me of like the uh, security suit from uh, Dead Space 2. That's a really cool suit. We don't know. Um, and there being a secret ending in this one, I think they left that possibility open. And also with like how the story plays out a little differently, I wonder if that's also a case of just like, yeah, we're remaking it. Now, is this gonna bloody the Venture suit? God, that suit looks sick, by the way. Like, that is a really cool suit. So it puts you back in the uh, classic rig suit. Yeah, so this is just like uh, bloodied up all the time. I think this is the level three or four suit which we'll get later, but yeah, this being all bloodied up. And then uh, the final skin that they gave you for pre-ordering, well, actually in the deluxe edition, rather. The marker writing all over the, the rig. Honestly, they did such a good job with the suit for this remake. Holy shit. But yeah, this is uh it's gonna have writing of the marker all over on the uh the armor pieces. It's a pretty good one. It's pretty cool. Those are all the suits. Plenty of armor. Um, Go for suit level two. Upgrade, baby. I did change it back then. I was worried it was just going to keep me in the DLC suit. Let's continue on.
the upgrade graph has been extended, so we have more options right away. Nice. I was very hesitant on doing HP there. I was like, ah, I'm not so sure about this one. We'll take it, we'll take it. Yay, Mepe! Ha ha! Ha ha! Fucking Christ. Dude, I don't like how dark it is. I really hate it. I hate it so much. It's way too fucking quiet, man. Oh, so it tells you when I can pull something with the kinesis. Got it. It's too fucking quiet. I don't like it. Oh my god. This is how I get the plasma rifle? The pulse rifle? Not bad, not bad. That's one of the uh, the arms of the necromorphs impaled her. And now I am dropping frames. Game, I need you to recover. Please. I should have got this on Xbox. I should have got it on Xbox. There we go. There we go. Calm down. Calm down.
med bay. Isaac, have you heard from Daniels? We were attacked. She ran the other way. No, nothing. Medical's a slaughterhouse. They barricaded access to the morgue. The morgue? Yeah. But the barricade was put together in a hurry. A hydrazine tank might blow it open. Just need a detonator, like maybe a shock pad. Nicole could be through there if... Isaac. The one who attacked us. I swear to God it was Chen. But... I saw him die. If they barricaded the morgue, maybe it was to keep something in. Time to find a hydrazine tank, huh? Level two, security clearance required. You got it. When I get level two, I promise I will be right there. Well, first, time to go to imaging and diagnostics. It's so similar yet so different. Oh my god, what the hell? Trouble with life off world? Do you miss the atmosphere? Have you recently been diagnosed with serious illness? We're here to provide you a top tier counseling and support. Depression, terrestrial logging, terminal illness. are in there. Great. Oh, this is insane. This is fucking crazy! Oh! His chest ripped right open. Holy smokes. Wait, didn't I just get the plasma or pulse rifle? Why do I keep calling it plasma rifle?
Dude, I heard the noise. I jumped so quick. Patient log retrieved. I hear the tests on patient Aww. Harris were inconclusive. Given the reports from the colony, he's lucky to have his faculties at all. Well, a divine experience would leave an impression on anyone's mind. Perhaps. But I saw nothing divine in all that blood. The suicides. This is a revelation, Terence. We just need more insight to translate it. You think this insight can be found in Mr. Harris's psyche? I'm positive. And with Captain Matthias barring any visits to Aegis 7, this fellow may be our best chance. Harris is Dr. Brennan's patient. In your method. Look, Mercer, things are complicated enough already. I can't sign off on this. You'll do what's best, of course, but... How long do you think you'll do it? Bro! the corner. Yeah, it's crazy how different yet new all the, like, not different, how similar yet all new this is. Wait. wait. It's crazy how similar, wait, familiar, fuck, different yet familiar. That's the phrase. Thank you. I'm done. Good night. I got it. <laughs> Diagnoses are stacking up as fast as I can file them. Sleep paralysis, hallucinations, nightmares, paranoia. I'm getting patients from all over the ship. No underlying cause is showing up in environmental analysis, foodstuffs, or radiation levels. I admit I'm at a loss. Mercer says he and Kine are working on a hypothesis, so in the meantime, I'm treating the symptoms. I'm seeing some improvement with sensory deprivation treatments in our zero two therapy pods, but the sheer number of patients we're managing bothers me. Those, symptom, those systems are old, and they need an overhaul. So many pods active, I worry what might happen if there's a serious power surge down there. But nothing else seems to help. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Stop it. I suppose the odds are low enough. I'd rather take a small calculatorist than have dozens of miners and engineers impaired around heavy machinery. I got it. Jesus! Groovy. Oh, you only have to do it once. That's an interesting choice they made. There's always ping. Zero G therapy, uh huh? What do inventory look like? Plenty of plasma cutter rounds. We're doing great. How quiet it is. I hate it. Entering vacuum. Entering zero gravity. Yo.
It's all the same yet different. It's crazy. Why is it pitch black in here? She sets with the fall, okay. Welcome to Zero Gravity with Dead Space 2 controls. Oh, there are people in here? Yeah, so much better than what it was. Do what? Still holding this position. What's happening there? Did you find Nicole? No sign of her yet. But I found some hydrazine that should work on the barricade. I just need to find a shock pad. Okay, work fast, Isaac. I'm just blown away by how this game looks. That can't be good. What the hell? It shut the whole ship. I'll check it out. Entering vacuum. Great.
Not today. Oh shit, can I still take off? It's not zero gravity anymore. We can still take off. Let's go. <laughs> we bucked it. Woo! Oh no, wait. Exiting vacuum. Oh, God. Took one step out of the captain's net to Chen's that thing. He almost got me. You okay? I trapped him in a damaged escape pod. He's snarling like, this is fucked up. Hurry, Isaac. Exiting zero gravity. What is that noise? This game is absolutely beautiful. Like, it is gorgeous. Use your own limbs against you. I was ready. I was ready. I would nail one of them to a wall. Also, good to know, like, I don't need nodes anymore. Like, for keys. They are used to upgrade, not to unlock things. So, that's... I have to remind myself of that as I proceed through the game. Impaling and throwing. Yeah, 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 you can pick that up and you uh, throw it. Yeah, I've been doing that this whole time. Thank you. Sheesh. Hazardous anomaly detected. Quarantine activated. That guy sounds serious again. Yo, okay. Where you at? I heard you breathing down there. If 
I see any of you moving around, you're gonna get this pipe. We got him, we got him, we got him. Oh, that doesn't count? All right, that's new. Grab one of those. Oh, it's me. This must be Nicole's office. Then I didn't look at the door on the sign. Personal log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. It is. With medication and zero G therapy, patient Harris is showing improvement. If this continues, there might be hope for the others on Aegis 7. However, Dr. Mercer continues to interfere. He claims Harris's delusions are religiously significant. If I have to make a complaint, I will. I'm not losing my patient over unitology bullshit. Not again. Tracking rig signal. Dr. Nicole Brennan. Rig location? Inconclusive. Manual rig tracking is available. She's every Nicole, she's everything to me. And she's lost somewhere on board. I had to find her. Get us both out of this hell. Can't reach the emergency room until so yeah, that's the next step. And so eventually get that, so we'll get that pad. Patient log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. Dr. Brennan. Okay, dictation on. I'll keep your name out of the transcript. Thanks. It's just hard to remember what's real. Your church mentor talked to you again. He knows me and my girlfriend want to leave. I can feel it. Our last seminar was all about heretics. How every unitologist who leaves is an enemy of humanity. Unitology is big enough to take care of itself. This is about what's right for you. Just be careful. The church pulls out of the pulls out these tricks when they feel threatened. They have neuro neuropsychiatrists too. Even if you get out, they'll try to. Dr. Brennan? Sorry, I did something happen? I had a patient who I tried, and her son tried so hard, but she I will fight for you with everything I've got, but never underestimate how strong the church's pull can be. That ties into a bit more of what happens in Dead Space 2. Like, there was a lot more about the Church of Unitology in Dead Space 2 about, like, how their influence is, like, vast. I saw this really great article on The Escapist where they talked about how the scariest thing in Dead Space isn't even, like, the enemy, like, the necromorphs. It's literally, like, planet cracking itself. I could have looked at the door. It probably says her name right there. Yeah, it does. Um... Which is fascinating, like, to just see the implications around here, just, ooh, let's not go there yet. That's similar yet different. Um, which is really fascinating to go through, especially to, like, uh, um,
Then what in God's name is happening down there? Precisely that. God's work. How can you say that? These deaths at the colony. The paranoia, the hallucinations. You wanted a scientific analysis? Cause and effect? Well, it all began after they raised the marker. What are you so worried about? The marker is divine. We know this. Look, it'll be on board tomorrow. You can study it then. Put your mind at ease. At ease? People are dying. How can that be the transformation the teachings promise? We're witnessing a new beginning. Terence, for unitology, for humanity. Of course our faith is being tested. Everything is about to change. That's what worries me. And recording. Seal entry. Hmm. That was, uh... Captain Mathis. The vid logs from the colony are poor quality, but I've seen enough to confirm the discovery to Ben. The artifact appears to be a genuine marker, the first to be found since Unitology's founding. We must get it on board at the first opportunity so I can begin a proper study. I can't even imagine the potential of such a find. The black marker offered revelations beyond our wildest dreams, and that was without the benefits of current analytical technology. This new marker, what secrets could it have? What wonders could it offer to humanity, to the Church of Unitology? Without EarthGov here to seize them first. This marker could herald the dawn of a new age, and I will do my part to see that age come to pass. Maybe this is fate, and in the darkest time of my life, the church and its teachings comforted me, saved me, and now I'm here in the right place at the right time to be of service to all humanity to repay those blessings. Amelia, if only you could be here now. So what's interesting too is uh, in that article on the escapist, which you should definitely check out if y'all are interested in like a little additional like what if of dead space and potentially that is a pretty sound theory was the question of like um the the markers of alien origin so who's to say yeah don't believe the lies um who's to say that the marker um hasn't been infecting people since it was found on earth um because what the marker does, it causes the dementia, the hysteria, and paranoia, but then also manipulates the mind. So, like, there could have been people on Earth who are all a part of the Church of Unitology anyways. Now suddenly, like, well, Unitology is great. Why wouldn't you like Unitology? Because do they like Unitology because of its teachings? Or do they like Unitology because of the influence the marker has on the mind? But also, there's like that greater thing because EarthGov took it, so it's stolen by the government. The government owns the original marker, and the, you know the guy died, so it was a martyr for the religion. Um, Surgical log, Dr. Charles Mercer. Copy to my secure terminal. I convinced Jurgens to show me the video feed from the colony. It's remarkable to find the answer I've sought all my life. The miners, this transformation, the divide death self. Kain is erring on the side of caution. His faith has been shaken by these necromorphs, as he calls them. How strange. When my own faith has been so richly rewarded. Where's the without Kain? I must study one of these creatures. Or the next best thing. Brennan's patient, for example. Oh my god. All right, so that goes to exploration of the uh, room. It's fine. It's got a little reload speed, huh? It's a little faster. Take it.
All right, babies. Prosthetics room. It's no longer the. Oh my god. So his specimen 426 is ready for harvest, so it's about to notify Alvarez to prep for medical leave when I checked the database and saw Ensign Sable has been moved ahead of her. Is that right? Alvarez has been on the waiting list for three months now. I thought arm transplants took priority over a cornea. Here's your, cleric Here's your clerical error. One of them bought CEC stock at the last purchase. One didn't. Guess which one was suddenly bumped up to vital personnel. It's not worth the headache to push back on it. Trust me. And before you think about filing an ethics complaint, just remember the wise words of Hipp Hippocrates. Shit rolls downhill. Yeah. CEC has a lot of money going into the church unitology. BT dubs. Yeah, I do like some of the, so yeah, it's worthwhile going back through the text logs of this because they are different. Um, and they do explain a lot more of the story of what's going on. Show me, show me, show me. What the? Am I falling? What the fuck? I could have pinned it to the wall. I do like they added that as well into this. That's a Dead Space 2 mechanic where they kind of made it a little more clear as to what could be utilized as weapons in the environment, so that's fun. Limb stimulation therapy. How's that stimulation, pal? Feeling good? Oh, nice. My power did. Dude is toasty. My god. I need those shock pads, please. Thanks. Daniels isn't answering her rig link. What's your status? I found a shock pad I can use on the barricade. I'm heading back there now. Watch the voltage on that pad. I'm not losing anyone else. Oh, that... <laughs> I did that. That was me. I'm like, Jesus Christ. Well, uh, 
troublesome scenario that I didn't have in the 2008 playthrough. I'm running low on some supplies here. Plenty of ammo. Tons of ammo. Oh, I'm doing okay on health. So that's not too bad. That's the one I was mostly concerned about. Also, significantly less money. Very concerning. Captain Matthias's body. Get his rig codes, and the computer's all ours. Oh, man. We're here already? <gasps> Don't open that door. They have come. Hey, it's okay to be fucked up. Okay. Damn. They changed the shape of this room. Transmit to all personnel. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan. Medical is overwhelmed. We need help. Look at his wounds. We can't handle so many trauma cases, and the command crew won't tell us what's happening. Seizing. Shit. Maybe I have some cage we left. Stasis module right there. All right, let's go follow Nicole's hologram. Medical log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Now it's the only place I feel safe. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. Genetically, it's human tissue with bizarre mutations. But it's just a sample. It's not enough to figure out a cure. I need. Wait, where's that report from engineering? Engineers pulled something out of machinery. Limbs missing, torso intact. Okay. Time for a real autopsy. I did. Oh, but finally cut this body.
Where's the battery? Dr. B. Warwick. Harris is asleep after another dose of sedative. He seems literally unable to sleep without chemical aid. Most people succumb to exhaustion after more than 50 hours of waking, regardless of circumstances, not Harris. His bizarre explanation of the events on the colony points to the same paranoia we've seen elsewhere planet side. His guilt was not in doubt. Two security officers were present when he took Dr. Sorello hostage and murdered Nurse Evans. And Harris doesn't deny his actions, but he shows no remorse. In fact, he insists there was no crime, specifically that Evans wasn't a nurse when he killed her. This is classic sociopathic behavior, but Harris exhibits no other symptoms. He is affable and friendly, able to empathize and offer original opinions. When questioned about Evans' murder, however, he becomes withdrawn and uncommunicated. He claims the explanation is stuck in his mind, and that talking about it mixes up its message. He also undergoes intermittent hallucinatory periods, again similar to those experienced by other colonists. During his long wake waking periods, Harris exhibits writing behavior on any available surface, claiming the dreams need to speak and that he is attempting to make it whole again. What that means, I haven't determined yet. Given the complexities of his case, I plan to reach out to my colleagues for more insight. Well, that's horrifying. Oh, oh, you are, oh my god. Where's this battery? I'm sure no power is being used. Oh, I see. I got to turn the light out to pull the battery out. Skills! Fucking skills! I used a fan blade to slice that motherfucker! Pin that one to a wall! Yeah! This ain't my first rodeo! Anyways... Where's the positivity? <clears throat> Shireart, how's it going? You seem like a wonderful individual because uh, you are. You're super kind and always supportive in all of my streams. And I greatly appreciate you showing up into the stream. Uh, love you, by the way. Just let you know. That's all. That's what it's for! That's what it's for! Well, now you know. I didn't ignore all my points. Oh. <laughs> I have to kill them positively? That sounds so awful. Like, it sounds fucked up. That doesn't mess up my VOD. It goes up as is. They really moved this stuff around. Like, I am all sorts of turned around.
Baby! It's a part of the viewing experience. It would not ruin the bot. Oh God. Security request retrieved. You left me. I woke in the dark with them scratching in the walls. Scratching like rats. And you will lock me in with them. Fuck it. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. <laughs> that is not good. My God, you got mauled. Little devil, aren't you? Oh, you too, eh? Mercer, it's Terrence Kine. You were in surgery, so I left this with Warwick. He'll be discreet. I just got the latest report from Agent 7. The situation's worse than Captain Matthias will admit. 40% of the colony's population is now showing symptoms. Depression, hallucinations, more violence. People are dying down there. I know it's linked to the marker somehow, but I just don't have enough data. Or sir, maybe I was wrong. We need answers by any means possible. That patient, Brent Harris, might be our last hope. That is uh, way more messed up in this version than it was in the original. Game looks so fucking good, by the way. Alright, uh, so I need a battery. Jettisoned out this way. Let's go to the morgue! Let's bring it Great space to be. Great space to be, dead space to be. I'm only on chapter two, that's crazy. Oh, man. 
All right, so we know what we got to do. We are fucking this thing up. Oh, free stasis? Cool. Yo, wait. Oh, this is different. This is different! Oh! Oh, no. Don't use any other weapon. Uh, it is my unfortunate duty to officially pronounce Captain Benjamin Matthews dead. Reports of the exact circumstance. That was fucking sick, though. Um, no, because that one will keep making really aggressive necromorphs. I can't let that thing run loose in a morgue. No, thank you. Uh... Reports of the exact circumstances surrounding his death are conflicted and will be left for investigators to determine. Oh, why can't I use other weapons? I, I believe there is an achievement still uh, for only using a plasma cutter. And I'm going to try to stick to that on this playthrough alone. Uh, reports of the exact circumstances surrounding his death are conflicted and will be left. Yeah, I will constrain my comments to the condition of his body. Subject was in generally good health for his age, though a cursory blood test indicates his leukocyte count was very low with eosinophilus, in particular almost non-existent. His pre-flight physical exam showed no such problems, indicating a rapid onset, but it does not appear to have any effect on his death. Multiple contusions on the arms and hands indicate a brief struggle pre-mortem. Light contusions around the rib cage indicate he was restrained, lightly for likely for a brief period. Cause of death: single prolonged trauma to the ocular body, which continued on through the cavity wall and into the frontal lobe, causing rapid neurotrauma, seizure, and death. The angle of penetration into the ocular cavity indicates the injury was not self-inflicted. Examination required the removal of the object to confirm cause of death but it has been preserved for the investigative team to study. There, I therefore have no alternative but to record a preliminary, preliminary verdict of unnatural death, whether deliberate or accidental, is beyond my jurisdiction. Isaac, what's your status? Do you have the captain's rig? Fuck me! Transmitting codes now. I saw it, Hammond. A flying one turned the captain's body into a, another one of those things. The same must have happened to Chen. God. Maybe the command computer has something. Uh, where's Daniels when you need her? Head back to the security checkpoint. It's safer there. At least I can upgrade your clearance. <laughs> Clearance confirmed. Your security clearance has increased. Higher clearance. Uh, doors and lockers are now accessible. Uh. 
Isaac. I'm here. What the hell's happening? The computer says the Ishimura's engines are offline. We're on a decaying orbit toward Aegis 7. Oh, God. I have to get to engineering. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Unless... Here. Head back to the flight deck. I'll guide you from there. If this damage report's right, there's a shortcut to engineering. I got 20,000 credits. Inventory is pretty uh, hefty. Oh, I got to take that to a bench. Um, I have it. I'm not going to use it. I, I'm not going to use it. I am tough. But just in case, I would like to have some on my purse. Groovy. Oh, I should have bought health. Whoops. My mistake, my mistake. We only have smalls. I have two small right now. Wait, was there a level one thing anywhere? Do I bother going back to open up everything that had level one locks? Yeah, that's level two clearance. where I just came from. I would have gone through here, down, there was that door, but it was locked. I probably would replay it, go back through all, and try to get all the achievements. I'm thinking about trying to do an impossible run. We'll see how uh, I feel after. Like, why are some of these locked? Just door locked, or is it? Okay, no. I come back through this area later in the playthrough, so. to the hangar bay because you can either take the tram or you could just walk there we're gonna take the tram flight deck tram controls <laughs>
Like, if I do, like, I... I don't know, like, if I'll... No, I mean, I can hand... Like, look how good this looks while I'm streaming. I can stream as much as I want in this game. Gosh darn it. I've already been in that bathroom. Oh, uh, yes. Security reporting retrieved. Yes, because I totally needed a reminder of that. Isaac, this damage report says there's a broken cargo lift just beyond the hangar doors. I'll open them now. Brand new. This is entirely new. But that lift shaft should take you straight down to engineering. That's why they have. Oh, I didn't think about that actually. That I did not think about. That's why they had the left stick for uh, sprints. Yeah, the L3. Uh, I didn't like it because I wanted to go back to classic controls, but now it makes sense that it's not because, well, this is how you turn left in zero G. That's how you rotate right. Brand new. This is crazy that they added this. Oh, you got better at aiming, didn't you? So did I, <laughs> sucker. Well, it's Yo, fuck. It's it's press the button to go sprinting. It's not uh hold to sprint. Punished for our sins, but by them. It's another engineer. Oh, God. I don't like how fast it's spinning.
Why a text log here? Adding this to my maintenance priority request. Maybe something in writing will make them pay attention. That unidentified growth reported elsewhere on the ship has reached engineering. Not even medical knows what the hell this stuff is. Looks like someone threw their guts up all over the walls. Smells about the same. It's spreading faster than we can cut it up, which is pretty disgusting in itself. It's already busted the cargo lift, and it's getting into the engine spoke. If we can't find a way to stop it soon, it'll all be over the main engine chamber by the day after tomorrow. Meantime, I'm heading to the mining deck. They've got PFM 100s in storage for ice mining, and they can spare the fuel. Maybe cauterizing the stuff will do the trick. Just hope it doesn't smell worse when it's on fire. All right. Is this like a checkpoint room? It's an elevator. Okay. All right. So this is not the end of the stream, but everyone that tuned in for the VOD, thank you so very much. I greatly appreciate it. It's a little bit spliced up, a little bit caught up. No big deal. But uh, yeah, that should be part one of the playthrough of Dead Space 2023. Uh, so everyone that watched that VOD, thank you very much. And if you're watching Hot After... The original, what did you like about the original compared to the remake? Me personally, just the whole change of everything being a little bit different, but very similar. This new path, I'm really looking forward to checking out. And that's going to be a great starting point for part two on the VOD if you're checking it out on YouTube. So, thank you so much for you YouTubers. But for you stream viewers, if you were watching live, well, you still get to see a little bit more Dead Space. But first, let's take a little bit of a break here. I'm going to get a little beverage. We'll sit right back down and resume right where we left off here on the stream. So don't go away. I'll be right back momentarily.